Hi, I'm Carrie Kendall and Playboy's Miss September 1990. Okay, and you have some tattoos you'd like to show us, right? I do. I have quite a few tattoos. Actually, the first, my very first tattoo is on my hand. I did that myself when I was 13 years old. Hmm. I used to, in eighth grade, whenever we'd have a project in art class with India Inc. I would sit in the back of the class and give everyone tattoos. I still have people coming up to me or, or on Facebook saying, hey, I still have the tattoo you gave me in eighth grade. <laughs> anyway, I have this small one back here I was telling Shane about. It used to be an outline of a broken heart and I liked the tattoo better then because it had meaning. It was to remind me that I've been through really difficult situations before because, you know, when you going through something really tough, you think it's the worst time you've ever had, but it's not. we have been through it before. So I put the tattoo there to remind me, you know, we got through it before, we can get through it again. But then I filled it in when I got married the first time, and now I don't like it anymore, so I have to change it. Um, my other tattoo, I drew this on myself. You know, you have one of those friends that calls you on the phone, and for like two hours, you just sit there and go, uh-huh, uh-huh. Well, I have one of those, and she called me up, and so I got this, uh, I was doing the uh-huh, uh-huh, and I had a little eyeliner brush and some water and some black um, eyeshadow. And I sat there and just listened to her talk and I drew it on. I just kind of painted it on there. And I liked it so much when it was done, the next day I took it to my tattoo place and I had them do it. They straightened it out, fixed it up, put it on there. And then my last one is self-explanatory. That's my son's purpose. And his initials and his birthday. Very cool. All right, so I'm looking for ideas to maybe change this one. Now that it has no meaning, it really has no place on my body because I believe all tattoos should have meaning. That's just my personal opinion. Nothing irritates me more than waiting for my tattoo guy and seeing people come into the shop and go, I don't know, what do you want to get? And looking at the pictures on the wall that drives me absolutely fucking insane. Sorry, can I say fucking on Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but it does. It's like, how do you walk in here and go, oh, I don't know what I want to get? A tattoo, to me, it should mean something. Okay. And that's a nice shirt you got on there. Where, yeah. What's the website that you are uh, promoting over there? Talesofthetat.com. Okay. Talesofthetat.com. Cool. Here it is. What else do you have in store? Anything coming up? Um, I don't have anything coming up right now, but I am on Facebook, Carrie Kendall, K-E-R-R-I-K-E-N-D-A-L-L. -L. I do sell my autograph photos directly. Um, I also put up auctions about once a month on a site called ABI Bids. Those are more collector's items photos because I'm still doing the photo shoots myself. The winners of those photos, the winning bid, sole owners of that autograph photo. So those go for a little bit more. Cool. All right, thank you so much for taking time and talking to us. All right, you guys are great. Tales of the